Okay, so we have a large mass of an asteroid before, let's say, an asteroid out in space gets a little too close to the sun, heats up the gases in the middle, and explodes into two pieces after that. So let's say the momentum beforehand is going to the left at I don't know, 100 meters per second. And we're dealing with a mass of 100 kilograms. Nice round numbers. So momentum before, it's got an equal momentum afterwards. So MV beforehand has to equal to M1 V1 plus M2 V2. Those are the little pieces I have after ones. V1. You know what? I'll call this just V, and then I'll have M1 V1 before and after V2. And let's say we know we'll need some masses of the particles afterwards. So we have a 60 kilogram chunk and a 40 kilogram chunk. And let's say the velocity of the one on the left is going, I need to make that up. How about trying to think of something that would make sense. 30 meters per second, find how fast the other one is going. So approach is the same, 100 kilograms, 100 meters per second. And 60 kilograms at 30 meters per second plus 40 kilograms at some V2 we don't know. So do some math. We got 10,000 here on the left. That's the total momentum we're dealing with. 60 times 30. Grab a. The more I do in my head, the more likely I could be wrong. I have 1800 kilogram meters per second plus 40 times V2. This would be subtract the 1800, subtract the 1800. We're at 8200 is equal to 40 V2 divided by 40 divided by 40. V2, 205 meters per second. Ah, but I made a mistake. What mistake did I make? That's the question. I made both of these positive. Problem is they're going in opposite directions. One's going to the left, one's going to the right. So honestly, this 30 meters per second should be negative. So this 1800 should be negative, which means I'm adding it to both sides, which means instead of 8200, this is 11,800, which means instead of 205, I have 11,800. Divide by 40, 295. There you go, 95. That's how fast B2 is going. There you go. So I'd be careful because they're moving in opposite directions, I had to consider the sign, and one of those has to be negative. As long as one of those is negative, the other end up being positive. As long as you keep track of that, you're good to go. Stop the record.